One of the most anticipated games on the entire 2023 NFL schedule is coming up this Sunday as the Miami Dolphins will travel to Frankfurt, Germany to take on the Kansas City Chiefs. Miami and Kansas City each enter the game at 6-2, and both teams feature star players and potentially explosive offenses. But the matchup is also the first time that perhaps the NFL's single most explosive player will play against his former team. Dolphins wideout Tyreek Hill, of course, spent the first six seasons of his career with the Chiefs before getting traded to Miami last offseason. And Hill is looking forward to the matchup, I'm ready, man, Hill said. It's just another game. Like I said, I'm just excited to play against my old brothers. It's just like if you're in high school and move to a different city. It's still ball. At the end of the day, my job is to go out there and do what I've been doing all year, that's have fun, help beat this team, create opportunities for whoever. So, I'm still gonna be the same old cheetah, baby, since joining the Dolphins, Hill has put up the best receiving numbers of his career. He posted career highs in receptions, 119, and receiving yards, 1,710, in 2022, and he leads the NFL in receiving yards, 1,014, and receiving touchdowns, 8, so far this season. Kansas City got by just fine without him last year, posting the league's most efficient offense and eventually winning the second Super Bowl of the Patrick Mahomes era. This season, the team seems to miss him a bit more. The Chiefs are still looking for a true receiving complement to Travis Kelsey, as players like Sky Moore, Kadarius Toney, Marquez Valdez-Scantling and more who were acquired since the Hill trade have struggled to produce. Rookie Rassi Rice looks like a potentially very useful piece, but the Chiefs have taken their time ramping him up to a full workload. Meanwhile, Miami is the team with the NFL's best offense this season. The Dolphins lead the NFL in yards, points, FTN's DVOA, True Media's EPA slash play in basically every other measurement of offensive production. And Hill is perhaps the single biggest factor in that success. Now, he gets a chance to make it happen against his former team.